Hey everyone, Josh here, and welcome to Evoto. With the power of AI, Evoto gives photographers the creative option to enhance their photography. Evoto has a very simple platform and an overall layout that allows you to access a lot of its features right off the bat without having to go through any menu or any settings. On the left, we have the presets. On the right, we have all of the color options, blemish removal options, and on the bottom, you'll see a list of our photos that we're currently editing in this project. Let me show you how powerful Evoto can be. With just a few clicks, we're gonna remove the glare from this person's glasses. Under portrait retouching, we're gonna scroll down to eyes, then go to glasses glare and play with this slider until we're happy with the overall result. It's really that easy. Similar to this photo, we're also gonna remove the glasses glare, and you can see how effective this effect can be in multiple different types of environments. To remove acne or other face blemishes, adjust the sliders under blemish removal. Is there a wrinkly shirt? No problem. Go to clothes and accessories touch up, then go to de-wrinkle clothing. Play around with the slider until you're happy with the ending result. Is there a background you want to remove or replace? Go to the background adjustments tab and you can click on any of these background presets. You can also play around with gradients and other palettes by clicking on the more button. To remove stray hairs, go to portrait retouching, then scroll down to hair and use the remove stray hair slider until you're happy with the overall result. Color correction is also very easy and it is located at the top. Here we can use color curves, HSL, and master color wheels in order to get the grading and correction that we want. You can also use presets to make very quick adjustments to your photos. The presets are located on the left, and as we cycle through them, they will not only make changes to the color, but also to the retouching. Evoto is also very good with batch editing. All you have to do is go to one photo, make the changes that you want, and then you can save this as a preset. Name it however you like, and then the preset will be located on the left under My Presets. You can apply this to multiple photos at once. Evoto can be downloaded for either Mac or Windows. Go to evoto.ai and click on the download button. Once the download file has been installed, simply double click and let the installation do the rest. Once it's downloaded, the software should open up and you'll be greeted with a window which tells you the latest features from Evoto. You can easily exit out of that window by clicking on the next or the X button. And now we can create a new project or access an older project. So I hope you enjoyed this short introduction to Evoto. Make sure you check out the link down below, download it, and give it a try. Also remember to subscribe to the YouTube channel, and I'll see you in a future video.